Hi, everybody. Oh, Scampy. Shake hands. Very good. Shake hands. Oh, both feet. Very good. Shake hands. Very good. <laughs> Gabby. Good boy. Okay. So we all went to the vet yesterday. I was only going to take two of them, but the vet said, hey, let's bring them all in. Get it all done straight away. Very quickly. Uh, so what they all got was little implants to lessen their hormones, to stop them. Mostly him. I, I noticed with him, he was like um, trying to mate with his food bowls and pine cones and his swing and uh, pillows and all sorts of things. So, and you know, there, others are like that as well. They're trying to regurgitate for, eat, well, not each other, for us really. They're not bonded to each other. They prefer humans. But yeah, they're all a little bit wild and wacky. So I wanted to see if these hormonal implant reducer things would help. Uh, it's going to take a couple of weeks for them to kick in, <laughs> these two. And I'll just show you on Scampy whereabouts they were done. So he's got a tiny little implant on his back, right behind his wing there. Tiny, tiny little implant. They all do now. And uh, I'll show you the video when we were at the vets before and after they got it done. Uh, there's not much difference in the videos. But um, yeah, I'll put that at the end of this, hopefully. Remind me to post that if I don't do that. Uh, I've got a little sky. Come here, sweetie. So they all, so you're just like, I'm here. I know how to do this. <laughs> She's like, I'm here. You are. <laughs> so they all got weighed and I knew this already. Sky was very overweight. She's a big tubby bubby. She's 126 grams for a Quaker. That's a lot. Uh, she should be a hundred at the most. The seat is 106, so for a little Quaker, she should be like 96. I'm not focusing, there you go. So yeah, they're all a little overweight. But uh, yeah, we noticed her today, which I never knew before. She's eating everyone else's food. I'm trying to get her to come to me, <laughs> to give her a bit of exercise. Here she is. Hi, boo-boo. You want to come sit up top? You can sit there. You can't? Oh, okay. Oh, sugar. Okay. So yeah, uh, got to work out how to reduce that. So no more sunflower seeds, no more safflower seeds, uh, no more corn, and uh, I don't want to say no more fruit, but we might have to do that for a little while. At least try and find fruits with the least amount of sugar, and there's a bit of conflicting information out there. <laughs> Since all fruit these days that you get from the supermarket is just really sweet and really sugary. But, uh, and less amounts. I was doing one tablespoon of seed or one tablespoon of pellets. Uh, and that's, you know, more than, well, that, that's a really good diet amount, but I don't know, is it too much still? Are you tubby? So the way they can see that and to find out if she is overweight or just a big bird is they wet down the feathers, spread them apart and see the fat all down her body here. You can see how she's got that little crevice in the middle. They've all got a little... <laughs> a little crevice down the middle of their body. Yeah, that kind of shows that they're fat already. But yeah, she's got fat, fatty deposits up here and down below. I should do that. That's going to make a whole meal. Oh, Kippy. What's your name? You shake hands? Very good. Shake hands? Very good. He's a good boy. Okay, now I've got three of them and it's scaring me. So they all got the implants done and they did very well. And I got to hold them as they came out of the anesthesia, which wasn't very long. It was like, I don't know, it took like five minutes to do. And uh, <laughs> Ryder had his eyes open the whole time while he was under. And it was hard to tell whether he was awake or not until he started moving. Scamp had his eyes shut the whole time. And when I was holding him, trying to wake him up, he just decided he was tired. He looked tired beforehand. So he was just, he just kept sleeping. And they said, you know, maybe, maybe give him a little nudge just to wake him up. And he's like, oh, right. <laughs> but he, he was happy just to keep sleeping. Good nap, huh? Uh, Sita was the last one to be done. And I kind of wasn't holding on to her well enough. I had her wrapped in a towel and you don't want them to flutter around when they're waking up because they're very drunk when they wake up. And um, 
if they jump, they're going to get very hurt because they can't land, they can't see where they're going, they can't fly, they go a bit nutty, they're a bit drunk when they wake up and I accidentally let go of her. And she flew around a little bit, she landed safely, which was good, and then we just put her in a little safety cage for her. You're a good girl, aren't you? She's so excited to be doing videos again, yay! Yay, so we'll see how this changes their person, well not personalities, but their, I don't know, see how they go. Yes, Ryder, where are you? Ryder! Ryder! R Come on, where are you? Ryder! <laughs> Come on! Come here! <laughs> no, I'm not going over there. These girls have gotten pretty close. Well, I don't know about Sky, but Sita's been really uh, attached to Sky. She follows her everywhere. Uh, she always wants to be with Sky. It's kind of cute, but uh, <laughs> Sky just wants me. Okay. Oh, oh, oh! I got to give a shout out to Bentley Boo. Bentley Boo, you're awesome. Uh, <laughs> thanks for all the cool comments and. Uh, the love for my Quakers here. Uh, thanks for showing us a little video of your bird. And I'd love to see more of them. Yeah, Bentley Boo's a very big supporter. So you guys say thank you, Bentley Boo. Okay. Alright. Yeah, I don't like um, editing videos and putting other clips on top of other videos because it just reduces my quality. But hey, let's do it. Let's do it so you can see <laughs> how I got them to the vets. I mean, I didn't get much video because I didn't want to be filming in there and the procedures and things. So I just got a little bit of video when I got there and just before we left. Okay. This is so This is a very naughty girl. Nice. Yeah. She's a good girl. She's been here Oh, this little lady. Okay. So look who we have here. Yeah, me. Oh, Sita, <laughs> Ryder, and Scamp, and I can't forget little poor little Sky. She's the only one who hasn't been here a hundred times. The other three have been boarding here a lot over their lives, but Sky is scared. Oh, maybe. <laughs> so they're all getting their implants to reduce their hormones. I was just going to do two at a time, but they are all here now, so, yeah. I wonder if we can sneak a video of getting it done, but maybe not. I don't want to disturb the vet. <laughs> all right, you guys. All right. All done. Scamby. Ryder. Sita. And. <laughs> Hello. I'm just going to rip it out. Good job, you guys.